What's up? Welcome to my channel. Today's video, we are going to Five and Below. I have not been there in the longest time, but they have the best stuff for the lowest price. So we're basically going on a Five and Below shopping spray. I love their store. You find all kinds of knickknacks and goodies. It's kind of like the Dollar Tree, but just like a little bit elevated. So we're gonna go there and just let loose and go crazy and find all kinds of goodies and we're gonna do it together. Also, I don't have any eye makeup on today. I was feeling like in the natural mood, so I just have like a full beat face with no eye makeup. Also, my shirt today, I don't know if you guys remember or saw my Ross haul. I got the shirt at Ross for my Ross shopping spree. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it down below, but the shirt turned out super cute and I'm wearing it today. Subscribe to my channel before you leave. Subscribe. Okay, let's go ahead and jump right in the video and let's head to Five and Below. Guys, we are here. This is a really good one. How cute this stool is and it's got a really pretty coloring on it and it is $5. Oh, it's really heavy. It feels super nice. I'm gonna pop that in my basket. <laughs> I feel like you could use that. Yeah, that looks really nice. I got cherries. Five dollars. Oh, that is cute. Thank you for some support. I support. They have really cute notebooks here, guys. Look how cute. Guys, they have so many hair accessories and brushes that are really cute. So I went ahead and grabbed some clips because mine always break or I lose them. So they're only $2.25 to replace. Dollar Tree has packs like this, but they don't have this many in a pack. Okay guys, they have LA Girls. I love LA Girls. So I found this really cute lip oil and a big bronzer. So I'm gonna try that out. And then they have a ton of lip products, eyeshadow palettes. Okay, I don't know if you guys know or not, but they have a big clothing section. And I just found these really cute shorts and they feel so soft and they're like $5. Look how cute this little caboodle is. I love the color of it. I don't need it, but like I love the color of it. Okay, they have tons of nail polishes and they look really cute, but this one specifically is standing out to me. It looks so cool. So I think I'm gonna grab this. I need all the clear coats in the world because I've been doing my own nails. So I'm gonna grab both of these. Uh, what? from five and below so i'm gonna go through the haul and show you guys every little thing that i got some stuff is aaron and ties maybe i'll skip through but i got a bunch of good stuff i was actually like pleasantly surprised ty where's the stool that i got probably in the car do you think that this is for you to sit on i guess not <laughs> look at my stool <laughs> guys i got this stool um it was five bucks are you kidding me they sell these at home stores all the time for way more than five bucks so i was pretty excited whenever i saw it Plus, I really like the color of it. They also had a gray one, but obviously you can tell this one's more of the tones of my house. So I'm probably just gonna stick it in a corner. I might put like a little decor item on top of it or something, but I thought it was such a cute little stool and I can't wait to use it. Okay, the next thing I got is a pack of Sharpies. I have never used a neon Sharpie before, but they had all the neon colors and Sharpies for $4. It says $400, but can promise you it was only four dollars so then i got a big pack of retractable pencils in our house we have so many pens but we just don't have any pencils so i grabbed these because i like to write in my calendar book also aaron's gonna be doing school from home for like the first few months um but in my calendar book i like to write in pencil because things always change in my calendar or planner so that way i can erase and i can't ever find a pencil in this house i really can't and it like honestly irks me a little bit just a little bit the next item i got is the la colors this we're about to try it on right now this is the ultra moisturizing formula lip oil let's test the makeup out Oh my God, it smells just like bubble gum. Mmm, oh, so pretty. It's stunning and it smells just like bubble gum. Oh my God, I didn't even realize it has like, I don't know if you guys can see, it has gold flakes in it. I think it's so pretty, but the flakes don't really come off. 
I really like that. That was a good buy. If you see that, nab it. Then I got, I showed you guys there, this nail polish. I have gel polish on, so I can't really try it out, unfortunately. But this is the Holographic Hypno Polish. And this one's in the shade Sentiment. Super cheap, but it looked really pretty. I hadn't really seen something like that. And I'm going to give it a go. The next makeup item I got is the LA Colors Bronzer. The color of this bronzer just looks so good. And I really like LA Colors. They're super affordable makeup. Okay. It looks pretty warm, but oh, I think it's gonna look good on. Yeah, see it flushes with my skin pretty nicely. I don't know if you can tell, I just swatched it right here. I think it's gonna look really good on my face. And I've been looking for a new good drugstore bronzer, so how perfect. Right. Oh, I did buy one more makeup item. I just picked up, which I'll swatch for you guys. This is, I think this is the felt tip. Yes, this is the felt tip liner from Wet n Wild. I really like this one and mine dried out. These do kind of go faster than a higher end one. Like they dry out faster, but it was so affordable. So it's not that big of a deal. Um, I like to do drugstore videos, which um, if you guys want me to do a full face of new drugstore makeup or something like that. I can, and that's kind of why I buy some of these products. So I, wow, look at that. Hello, pigment. They're so pigmented and they have like a nice felt tip and they're just so cheap, so these are great. Alrighty, let's move into clothing. For clothing, I bought two items. I'm not gonna try them on because they're loungewear and it's just like kind of pointless. <laughs> I guess maybe not pointless, but these are the softest shorts I've ever felt. I believe they're five bucks and they look really cozy. Like it feels softer than cotton. It feels like a little fuzzy. I got them in a medium and it's a fake drawstring on them, but that's okay. These I will definitely wear around. They also sell some that kind of look like this at Brandy Melville. I have a pair of green ones that kind of look like this for way more than $5. So in a weird way, these are a dupe. I do wish they had more colors because I definitely would have picked them up. And then I picked up this sports bra. It is like a pretty yellowy green color, or it's more of a yellow than a green. I picked it up in a medium. It was $5 as well, but it felt like really nice. It has like a ruching ridge, not a ruche. Like it's ribbed, I should say, a ribbed sports bra. And I actually thought this would be cute to like, not wear as a shirt, but like you could totally wear this with like some high-waisted shorts and kind of make this like a statement piece in a way. So that's why I picked it up. Um, I really like the color of it. Even though it's like super bright and stand outish. I thought, how cute is this? I grabbed it. Oh my gosh, I should have mentioned this with the beauty stuff. I picked up the Gel Extreme Shine Polish. So this is just a clear polish. I always use these whenever I paint my nails with regular nail polish as a clear coat. And my clear coats are drying out, so I picked up a fresh one. And this one is um, super, super affordable. I can never find like a good clear coat at the Dollar Tree, you know? So Five and Below has good stuff like that. You guys have a chewing gum problem and Ty is not helping it. I did not buy this. I did not buy this for myself, okay? He did this to me. You guys, I can never put this in my mouth and chew it on camera because you guys would throw up because of my smacking. Oh, this is my weakness. I love bubble gum so much. Hey, who got that for you? You! Yeah. You're gonna make my teeth fall out. Yeah. Okay, then I got a doorway sit-up bar. I have no idea if this is gonna work out, but you're supposed to just hook it under your door and put your feet. So you can do sit-ups, which sometimes at night I try to do a couple sit-ups, and I try to like put my feet underneath my bed, but we got a new bed that sits up really high, so I can't do that anymore. So I was like, hey, hey I'm just gonna get this. Babe, we should try it out. I'm so confused. Okay, you just like close the door on the block. Ty, you have to come try this out. Right now? You want to? Okay, we're gonna let Ty demo this out and I will insert the footage now. I think, babe, I think you put it under the door. Not like that. Or I guess, yeah, I guess that works. I think under makes more sense. Yeah, I think you like close the door on it. Might be a little difficult. Ow! Uh. <laughs> it's a little short for me. Might work better for you. Uh. Does it, it help? Yeah. Let me try to do one. You ain't ready for this kind of action. 
This is the content you do not need to see, but I'm gonna this provide it. This is the content it. you didn't know you came for. All right, here I go. I have no shoes on. Alright, go. I can take a nap. One, two, three, go. Wait. I mean, right. <laughs> Wait. There she goes. Come on. Two. Come on. Do five. One. Two. Do some overhead angles. <laughs> Please don't. Come on. Three. Yes. Up close. Four. Into the camera. I got this phone holder. It looked super nifty. It's like a phone stand. Let's open it up. So it suctions to your table. I have to pull the plastic off and then you um, press this down. Do you see what I'm saying? This little switch to suction it to your table. And then you have an adjustable phone holder that it just stretches. That's pretty neat, especially if you like film YouTube videos or you want to get into that or maybe you like want to sit in your bathtub or your room and like watch Netflix on your phone or on a plane. This could be really cool and it folds up collapsible so it's really compact. Um, I got one like this for a lot more money off Amazon. However, of course that one's like way more stable than this one, but this is still a really good deal and I'm shocked at like... The convenience of it this will be great to film tiktoks with too so it was really cheap and this was something that ty picked out for me <gasps> oh this is so cute you guys look how pretty this stone is i wanted this specific stone to put in my closet with my perfume section and um by the way it lights up it comes with like a light which i'm not gonna light it up so you can like plug the light in it and then you can like plug in the wall i'm actually not going to use this part i just wanted the stone um i saw on pinterest how people decorate with these so the crazy thing is i actually just ordered one of these off of etsy for a lot more money than this and it's about this size and then there it was in the store and i was like mm, they got me so now i'll have two of them but that's okay because like I love this so much and I can add it to a shelf, but I'm definitely gonna put this in my closet and not use the light part of it. But I was like, oh my God, I can't believe they have this here. So I was really excited about that find. Ty, what you buy? A cooling towel. That's Ty's fine, that's not mine. Working out. I got more Sharpies. I love Sharpies. We always need Sharpies and these disappear faster than anything. So they had this huge pack for $5. If you went to Target to get this, you would pay a lot more than $5 for this many Sharpies. So I thought it was such a great deal. That's why I got the neon ones as well. I actually just got the neon ones because I was like, what is this? What is this going to be like? A neon Sharpie. Then I got a fitness ball. Ty has to blow it up though. It's like in this box. <laughs> yeah. mm. I threw that to him. <laughs> then I bought hair clips. I showed you guys this in the store. I got these hair clips because um, I lose mine. And I also the little teeth on them break all the time. And like I put my hair on a clip every single night. Like I put it up on top of my head to get it out of my way. Um, so yeah, my Dollar Tree ones. They've already scattered about. You're kidding, right? Who bought this? You know when your drawers at your house are filled with random junk that you don't need? This is how you get there, by buying things like this. That was Aaron. Carnival funnel cake, pitcher and mix. The mix is in the container. You just add water. Water in this. My family be trying me, oh my lord, have mercy. Okay, so we've opened the workout ball just to show you guys. It looks pretty legit, huh? Yeah. I've been wanting one of these, but I didn't order one because I didn't want to pay for it a pricey one on Amazon because like my commitment level is pretty low to things like this. So when I saw a really cheap one, I was like that I can commit to. So I got this one. How much was it? I think it was like five bucks. Babe, will you try one of these sour yeah. warheads with me? Yeah. Okay. For candy, must have. I don't eat this. Do you guys remember the uh, episode of The Office where Michael's like pulling these out of his pocket in the speech and like throwing them into the ground? <laughs> <laughs> they weren't catching it. Airheads, sour punch straws, and warheads, extreme sour. So me and Ty are about to try this on camera for you guys. 
How's my hair? Camera. All right. Ready? He's been golfing this morning. A little cat head. All right, I'm ready for this. I loosened it for you. Mm-hmm. Just one. <laughs> that one's yellow. I'm not eating that. Okay, here. Oh, purple. 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 Ready? Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Just like I remember them. Oh my God. These are a lot easier than the regular size ones though. Yeah. Because they're smaller. Actually, that wasn't bad at all. I could eat the whole container. I thought it was gonna be way worse. Bet you won't eat two. Bet you won't eat this many. He's asking me to put this many in my mouth. Look! They're actually so good. You want one? Another one? Do you like my crystal? Mm-hmm. Five dollars? I don't know. I look like a dad in my little golf shirt. All right, guys, that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for being here and watching. Don't forget to comment down below because I want to know what's the next door you guys want me to take you shopping with, going on a shopping spree with. Um, yeah, but that's it for this video. Be sure and subscribe. Hit the subscribe button for you before you leave for more content like this. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Peace.